All right, guys, so for practice two of standard algorithm, we are going to do 857 times 14. So again, I've decided to color code my smaller number because we need the larger number on top and the smaller number on the bottom. If you would like to color code as well, you may, but just make sure that you have a piece of notebook paper or some kind of paper out. Um, you can do this with just a pen or a pencil, or if you have colors, you can do that as well. So with my larger number on top and my smaller number on bottom, we are ready to start. And so again, we always want to start with our smallest place value, which in this case happens to be the four that's in the ones place. So I am going to look at this at, as 857 times four. Okay, so what is 857 four times? So I know that four times seven is 28. So I'm going to put the 8 down here and bring my 2 up for my tens place. I know that 4 times 5 is 20, and then I need to add that 2 from before. So 4 times 5 is 20, plus 2 is 22. Again, bringing that 2 up. 4 times 8 is 32, plus 2 is 34. Remember, you can pause at any time during this video if you want to work ahead and then push unpause to go back and check with me. That is completely fine. So now we have just figured out that 857 times 4 is 3,428. All right. So in other words, we are done with the ones place in the number 14. Okay, so since we're done with that, I like to cross it out. You can also cross out your twos because we don't need those anymore. And it's important that once we cross out that ones place and we move to our tens place here, that we have that zero placeholder. This is to show we aren't going to have anything else in our ones place. Okay, because we need to look at this one not as a one, but as a ten, because it is in the tens place. So in other words, we are going to take 857 times 10, okay? So let's do that. One times seven is seven. One times five is five. And one times eight is eight. Wonderful. And that's pretty reasonable, right? That's pretty reasonable that 857 times 10 would be 8,570. So the last part is that we just need to find the sum of these digits to give us our overall product of 857 times 14. So if you'd like to pause at this point, you can pause and then unpause to check your answer with, with mine. So eight plus zero is eight. Two plus seven, nine. Four plus five equals nine. And three plus eight equals 11. So we have that 857 times 14 equals 11,998. How'd you do?